Yay. <laughs> Sagittarius Day. All right. Huntington is shutting down. Lots of people just busting through. This is how you know that the ego is real. Look how many egos have spent money, spent all this money so that they can spend their time around plants. All these people spending money just so they can spend time in an environment that was naturally way more beautiful pre-colonialism. It's pretty crazy being aware of the world pre-colonialism and what it's become today. It's quite a shame. So, <laughs> but you know, it takes awareness to start doing good things. That's why I'm sharing everything that I'm sharing right now. Being able to pull out this phone and talk to you about the space that I'm in currently is a conscious choice. And this, when it comes to Sagittarius and the number two, that being the theme of today, we can see that travel is dictated by choices. This whole day, for example, me losing my phone, that was not a choice. That was a mistake that came from me neglecting to continue being aware of this device in the way that I should have been. And by the time I realized that it was gone, I had to then locate it. So that connection to one's phone is huge. <laughs> if I'm being shown anything on this Sagittarius day, it's how one's ability to travel is dictated by one's phone at this point. And that's what the matrix is all about. So the matrix is all about keeping tabs on all of us. The matrix knows where we all are just because we have phones. And we're in a very special time where everyone just has phones now. Phones tracking what they do in the metaverse constantly so that masons can play god pretty awesome because <laughs> that's the power that mercury gave them they have the power to do all that so hey we're about to what just keep growing we got to keep growing we got to <laughs> keep being ourselves basically but do know that being yourself is a conscious choice me pulling out this phone to speak is a very conscious choice that I only have because I've been put in the space where I can wait for the soul that I'm with to go to the bathroom. Otherwise, the smothering effect would be stopping me from doing this video right now. So, it's important to have your own ego. When you have your own ego, you can tell people what you're going to do and you can make decisions for yourself. Me doing this video for you has to come from my ego because no one else here would decide for me to say anything about Sagittarius or travel or the ego wanting to connect to another ego. Okay, so this is why the imagination is only possible because of connections. You can take that. You're good. Literally, and we're all here choosing to spend time together. We're all here spending time with plants. We're all here creating an environment where we can strike balance and harmony with one another so literally <laughs> the person I'm here with just told me not to lose her bag since I already lost my phone so <laughs> and I, that's real so that's just a very real joke that another soul can make another ego can make and that joke is also coming from a serious place because they're worried about past events that's all one's connection to something else. And that would not be possible if you were not an individual first. So when you're in the Sagittarius space, you know you can't run away from yourself, basically. You're always gonna have to be yourself. You're always gonna have to uh, continue doing what you wanna do. And then you're just gonna have to factor that in with other people. And then that's where the empathy game becomes humans everything. Humans have to learn empathy, as we can see with Thanksgiving. All right, Americans celebrate Thanksgiving because they still have to learn empathy. They still have to learn how to care about others. Literally, <laughs> she's texting me there's thousands of dollars in this bag because she's a photographer. It's safe. It's safe. Souls keep you accountable though. This is why it's very awesome not being alone and knowing that we're not all one God, okay? 
we're actually all individual gods who have killed our egos by using our souls to suppress our minds. So when you are interacting with all these minds in this reality, they're all suppressed by their souls. Everyone's soul is suppressing themselves. And that's why we're suppressing ourselves when we interact with other souls. There's a bunch of stuff that I would be able to do that I can't do because there's so many people. So many people around me. Okay, so empathy is everything. And we have to see that we're real. We can look around and look at each other and see that we're real. Our souls are real. Our souls impress each other every day. I can be impressed by what these people are wearing. People are pretty fashionable. People are extremely fashionable. I can be very impressed by how a soul is dressed. I'm quite impressed by how you're dressed. I think that's what we got out of this video. Gang, gang, much love. ChaserGenes.com. Check out Always Ascending Academy. If you want to learn more about your astrological ability to travel. Yeah.